In this StreamYard tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can share your screen really easily in StreamYard so that you can show a presentation, a Chrome tab, an application. And I'm also going to show you a really cool little trick that I just learned about that allows you to play videos using this feature as well. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Sarah Nguyen and I help you build your business using video on social media with ease. I really love StreamYard. They're a versatile, powerful live streaming software option and the ability to share your screen is made really easy using their software. So let's go over to my computer and I'm going to show you how to do this now. Now in StreamYard, we'll be able to share our screen really easily. The option to do that is at the bottom here where it says share screen. So go ahead and click that. And once you click on that, you'll be able to choose between the different screen sharing options. So the first option that you have is if you've got multiple monitors, you can share your screen on either monitor. So you can choose screen one or screen two. And if you have more screens, they will appear here. You can also choose an application window. So if you've got perhaps a keynote presentation or you've got a particular app that you want to share, you can choose that from this section here. And the third choice that you have is the ability to share a Chrome tab and we're going to come back to that because there's a cool little feature that I want to show you where you can play video using this feature. So I'm going to start by sharing an application window. In particular, I'm going to share a keynote. So I've selected that here. So once you've selected whichever thing that you want to share, you want to then click on share this blue button here. So go ahead and click that. And now I can see a couple of things have happened. So StreamYard has added it to the screen for me so I can see it right here. I know that StreamYard is sharing it because they have this StreamYard is sharing a window little section here and this I can move around. Now I can do a couple of things with the screen share option. So just underneath the video, I can play with the layout. So at the moment it's got me in this small little picture and picture type of feel and then the screen share larger. If I click on the one next to it, it changes the layout. So it's completely just what I'm sharing on the screen. And then if I click on the other options, I can see how I can play with it. So if I click on the third one in, then it makes me a bit larger and then the screen share a bit smaller and it really allows you just to have some flexibility in terms of the layouts that you want to play around with. So that is as simple as it is to share your screen using StreamYard. Now the thing that you can do with this as well, so let's say that you're presenting during a live stream and you've finished presenting, if you click on the little um, screen share option at the bottom here, what, the, what that allows you to do is that you can remove it altogether from the live stream. So that's really cool. So you can present and once you've presented, you can stop the screen share and get back to the live stream presenting that you are actually doing. So another feature of sharing your screen in StreamYard is that you can actually open videos via a browser and play them during the live stream. So in StreamYard, you are able to upload videos, video clips here, but there is a restriction. They can only be 100 megabytes and the maximum length is five minutes. So what you can do is you can actually open a video that's an MP4 file in a Chrome tab. So you can do that really easily. So I'm going to drag an MP4 video that I have on my desktop over to my browser here. And then as you can see, the video is playing here. Now, how do I actually play this video on the actual live stream using the screen share option? So I'm going to go back to share screen. I'm going to click on that option. I'm going to click on share screen. And now I'm going to click on Chrome tab and I'm going to click on that video tab that's open. And then I'm going to select share audio because this will allow me to play the sound that's coming through on that video through the live stream. So that's a really cool way that you can actually use the screen share option to play videos through StreamYard. So now I'm going to click share and it's actually playing the video on the live stream here as you can see. So that's really cool. So if I drag the video to the other screen, I can control it from there. 
And that's essentially it. That's how you can play a video with sound using the screen share option in StreamYard. If you found the video useful, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel where I do lots of live stream tutorials and training to help you grow your business using video on social media with ease. Now, let me know in the comments, what are you presenting during your live streams? Are you sharing presentations? Are you sharing your screen? Are you doing demos? I'd love to know. And also let me know what are other live stream tutorials would you like to learn about? I'd love to make these videos for you. And in the meanwhile, you can also check out my live stream tutorial playlist or grab a copy of my Facebook Live cheat sheets. It's a super simple guide to get you up and streaming on Facebook Live, even if you've never hit record before. To get your hands on it, simply click on the link on the screen and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.